shares sad America won't be great in her lifetime due to Trump, instantly regrets it. Cher is so sad that America won't be great in her lifetime. The 72-year-old icon claims she has done a lot of reading on fascism and nationalism and has really done her homework. She's scared that the world may come to end due to all the damage President Donald Trump has done. Well, the aging singer instantly regretted her words as Americans gave her a reality check. President Donald Trump, left, share, right, photo credit, Alex Wong slash Getty Images, Scott Barber slash Getty Images. The Washington Post caught up with Cher in Las Vegas as she wrapped up a performance at the Park MGM Theater. And, there's no doubt she has had a legendary career, but claiming she is now an expert on political matters is taking it a little too far. But, that's what the Washington Post thinks, reporting, she's not just another Hollywood liberal trolling the right. Cher has done her homework, reading deeply on the history of fascism and nationalism. She takes in several newspapers and breaking news alerts a day, tweeting out links with fresh outrage. She's been known to call into MSNBC and fret about an irreparable erosion of American values. The Post asked Cher about surviving a nuclear war. There's an old joke maintaining that the only things that will be left are cockroaches and Cher. Cockroaches and Cher she replies. I don't know who said it, but I find it amusing. With the end of the world constantly on her mind, she was asked if she'd survive. She sort of giggled, sort of sighed. Not this one, she said. I wouldn't last through what President Trump could do. There's no lasting. Not even me. Not even cockroaches. Cher then reminisced about meeting her mother's gay friends at ten years old. And I thought, 